What's the matter? Forget that cats don't play with birds. Actually, I'm pretty forgetful. Just the other day, I... Scat! Oh! <laughs> Real mature, guys. I found our third guest. He was trying to run away without having tea. How rude. Now you three stay here. We have to get the last thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of here. Jet Jet. <laughs> Next time, a simple hi, hun, hun will be fine. What? We're alley cats. This is what we do. Praying and pouncing, darting and dashing. You know, being tough guys. <laughs> Not again. Sorry. Sorry. I... <laughs> Nice outfit, Dongua. It wasn't my idea. They dressed me up for a tea party. <laughs> tea party! <laughs> <laughs> I look absolutely divine. Madame, uh, can you help me with my bow? <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's not that funny, is it? Nope, it's even funnier! <laughs> Dongwa! <gasps> Do all you kitties want to get dressed up pretty? <gasps> hmm. Hey, cat! She's gone! Hey, cat! 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 Oh! oh. Hi there. Uh, she's gone, Cat. Oh, thanks. Ow! My wing. Oh, I think I hurt it bad. Here, let me help you. Hey, Dongwa! <laughs> Come on back. <laughs> We're not finished laughing at you yet. <laughs> Those cats sure don't like me either. Dongwa! Uh, I can't help you right now. Sorry. Oh! Ow! My wing! Ow. What's wrong? This game too tough for you? Uh, no. I was just wondering, like, what would you do if someone you knew was hurt? That's a silly question. We'd help the guy out, as long as it wasn't some mouse or bird. Uh, uh, yeah. Mouse or bird. You have to... Scare me, she... To make them... Stop! Oh! I can... Tell this is... Not gonna be easy! Who's there? It's me. I'm Dongwa, by the way. And I'm hi -O. Did you come back to help me? Swell! Uh, yeah. But you can't tell anyone. Great! I love keeping secrets. In fact, just the other day, a pigeon told me... Just come with me. Quickly. This way. If any of those cats see me with you... Where's my nest? I can't get better if I don't sleep. And I can't sleep without a nest. No! I'll get some sticks. You stay here. A cat building a nest. <laughs> this I gotta see. Hey, look what <gasps> Dog was doing. Oh, uh, hi guys. What's the sticks for? I, uh, I'm hungry. Oh. <laughs> Eating sticks, that's pretty tough. Yeah, give me one. No, wait, look up! Huh? Not you! Go back to the clubhouse! What 
do you mean, not me? What clubhouse? You know, the alley where we hang out. Our clubhouse. Right, our clubhouse. Where we have tea parties. Let's get out of here. See you later, tough guy. Now you have to stay here and not leave. I'll come back and check on you in the morning. Swell! Good night! Hey, Sawa! Yeah? Get some breakfast. Ah! How, how'd you get in here? Those nice cats with the collars like yours told me where you were. You know, Ohio, when your wing's better, you have to go back home, and I have to fix things with my friends. Ta-da! But I want to hang out with you. Come on, there's a great place to pick worms in the alley. Alley? No, wait! See? This is a much better spot. Just hurry! The best way to find them is to listen for them. How many do you want? Uh, I'll just watch. Dongwa! <laughs> hey, Dongwa! Stay here and look for your worms. I'll be right back. What were you doing with that bird? Picking worms? <laughs> <laughs> you weren't actually playing with him, were you? Play with a bird? Me? Why would I do that? In fact, I was telling him to get lost. <gasps> He's such an annoying bird. Uh... Oh, no. You're getting tougher by the minute. Keep it up. <laughs> Are you happy now? You're one of the guys. Oh. on that bird. What? You saw him? Where? This is right where I scared him. Did he say anything? Ah! He was really scared. Oh. Did he say anything else? Just that he was sad, he had no friends, and that you were the meanest cat ever. Then he went that way. That way? He'll get lost in the village! Excuse me, have you seen this bird? I'll take that as a no. Ah! You're back! No, I'm lost. Figures. Listen, about what I said before. It's just... La, 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 I can't hear you. Come on. I'm trying to apologize. Apologize? So you are friends with that bird. Don't worry, Mr. Katz. He's not my friend. That's right, bird. None of us are friends with you. Wait. That's not true. I'm his friend. At least, I'd like to be. 
And you guys can laugh at me all you want. I don't care. Come on, let's go. I knew it. You are a tough guy. Me? Huh? You can be yourself. That's the toughest thing of all. Thanks, Hun Hun. What do you say we go pick some worms? Swell! Hello, kitties. Do all of you want to come to my tea party? I have lots of dresses. Oh, no. This is sure going to be fun. Hey. Looks like you're going hey. to have the hiccups forever. Hey. I'm just not scary hey. enough. <laughs> hey, they're gone! All I needed was a good laugh! <laughs> Dongwa, how do I look? Swell! I was gonna say that! <laughs> <laughs> I hope our cats are ready for the calligraphy competition, reader. They have never been more ready. I really think this is the year we win. Well, <gasps> look who it is. Magistrate Wong, what a pleasant surprise. <laughs> this should be interesting. Why? That Magistrate Wong, he and our Magistrate go back a long, long way. And they always play silly tricks on each other. What? What kind of silly tricks? You'll see. Going to the Imperial Calligraphy Competition, too? You might as well go home now. Oh? And why is that, Magistrate Wong? Because I am going to win. I have two secret weapons. Special brushes made from the finest fox fur in all of China. And my daughter, Liu Chang, the most promising calligrapher in the country. You don't stand a chance. Really? Well, I have a couple of secret weapons of my own. Here we go again. Special ink. Direct from the Anhui province. And we are going to win. Because these are the most talented calligraphers in the country. Cats? Your calligraphers are cats? That's ridiculous! Ridiculous? We'll see who's ridiculous. Last one to the competition is a rotten thousand-year-old egg. Oh, hold on tight! with the ancient rules of this competition, I must impress upon you all the need for dignity, decorum, and above all, at all times, for quiet. I won! You're the rotten thousand-year-old egg. You won? What are you talking about? I won? <clears throat> Your magistrates, please. Oops. Sorry. I should hope so. It had better not happen again. Oh, it won't. That's a promise. Absolutely guaranteed. You won't hear a peep from us. Good. Watch out! <laughs> Are you all right? You'd better not try any of your tricks on me during the competition. Me? Play tricks? On you? I would never dream of doing such a thing. You, on the other hand... Me? <clears throat> Where are the silly tricks? I want to see them. Just concentrate on your writing. That's what matters most. Today's practice is now over. The competition begins tomorrow. Pardon me. The rules say nothing about cats, but they do state that only one calligrapher per household may compete. 
you must choose which cat is going to represent you. Hmm. Sagwa's style has the most flair. I choose her. Wow, you're really, really good. I love that one. Can I have it, really? Isn't this writing wonderful? Yes, it's lovely. Your calligraphy gets more beautiful every day. No, Papa. You don't understand. I didn't do this. It was one of the cats. One of the cats? I thought my old friend was playing one of his tricks on me when he said his calligraphers were cats. Well, just because he didn't play a joke on me doesn't mean I can't play one on him. <laughs> I can't wait to see his face when he sees what I've done to him. Round one of the Imperial Calligraphy Competition begins now. Stay calm. Just do my best. Even strokes. My special ink. It keeps vanishing. But how? Oh, I think I know what happened here. When we were young boys, I once played the same trick on him. <laughs> And now he played it on me. Hmm. I'm just going to have to think of something even better. I hope you're not going to let things get out of control again. Well, I can't just let him get away with it. Now can I? Ah, oh, you two are impossible. Wong? This is a serious breach of the rules. Very serious indeed. Finest fox fur. Ha! Wait till he sees these bristles in action. came all the way from Shanghai. Oh, well. I guess he got me. Hmm. I'm going to have to come up with something extra good this time. Leo Chong, excuse me. Do you know anything about this strange ink? Or the ink part, which seems to come from your own home? You seem like a responsible girl. But someone is breaking the rules, and I can't allow that. I'm sorry, but you are disqualified from competing. Please leave now. Why didn't Liu Chong say something? It was Magistrate Wong who switched the ink, not her. She would never dishonor her father, Sagwa. But it wasn't her fault. It's not fair. If you two hadn't played these silly tricks on each other, Liu Chung wouldn't have been thrown out of the competition. On the other hand, it does more or less help our chances of winning. Fix it. Um. Where is that writing exercise I did that Liu Chung loved so much? That'll cheer her up. Oh no! I am sorry, Magistrate Wong, but your daughter did not deny it. Look, Imperial Calligrapher, the other Magistrate has sent his cat to play a trick on me. I tell huh? you, he's behind all this. Well, now I am left with no choice. The cat is also disqualified. <gasps> Sogwa? Disqualified? 
Oh, I must sit down. Oh, I am sitting. Then I must stand. I'm afraid it's true, Your Magistrate. Something about Sagwa ruining Magistrate Wong's scrolls. Now do you see? Your pranks are only funny to the two of you. To everyone else, they are trouble. Now, what was it I said before? Oh, yes. Fix it! Magistrate Wong, you should know I was only trying to play a trick on you. I never meant to get Liu Chong into trouble. And I was only trying to play a trick on you. Sorry about your cat. Oh, if everyone knew what we'd done. We would be laughed at from here to Shanghai. No dignitary would set foot in our homes. Our family names would be ruined. But none of that really matters, does it? We must set it right at once. Hmm. Last one there is a rotten thousand-year-old egg. Calligraphers... Prepare your brushes. Oh, not you two again. It was all our fault. Our silly pranks got out of hand. We weren't thinking of the consequences. These innocent scribes should not be punished. They had nothing to do with it. Can't you let Liu Chong and Sogwa compete? Please? Reinstating wrongly disqualified scribes has never been done before. But is it actually against the rules? No, I don't think it is. Fine, they may compete. But you two must pay the consequences for disobeying the rules. We will gladly do whatever your imperial rules dictate. Congratulations! If you would step forward to accept the prize... This is the 63rd year in a row that you've won the prize. And now that our winner is retiring... At last! You will all have a better chance of winning in the years to come. Just you wait. Next time, I'll play the best trick... Well... Next time, I'll just let our talented scribes do what they do best. <coughs> See you next year, if my father and your magistrate can finish cleaning in time. Thank <laughs> you.